And we are back on our show, the Rebel Cup, the Pineville High School Rebel Cup, set to begin this weekend. It's an annual tournament, soccer tournament, Friday and Saturday. Very big this year, 39 teams. So, uh, well, congratulations. Thank you. We're uh, we're hoping the weather and the field uh, weather stays nice. The field stays dry. Weather looks like it's going to be good. Um, so we're well, we're looking Como? forward to it. Yeah. Tell us a bit about the tournament. It's been around for a while. Yeah, this is the 28th year mm -hmm. that we've had the tournament. We think uh, we think it's the oldest one in the state. Yeah. Um, if it's not, it's close. It, it's <laughs> it's got to be close. Yeah. Uh, I, high school soccer didn't really get recognized by LHSAA mm -hmm. until the mid to late 80s. So it's uh, it's been around for a while and. Um, you know, with 39 teams coming this year, it's the biggest it's ever been. Yeah. Uh, how are you manage? How did, were you able to attract such a large number? How did that go, How did that happen, Coach Como? Well, uh, you know, I, I've got connections throughout the state, mm -hmm. and I've just been trying to uh, beg and plead and <laughs> get these guys to, to commit. They they know that number one, the facilities in Alexandria are great. Um, mm -hmm. Johnny Downs uh, Complex is one of the best facilities in the state. It is. But also, uh, just our location, we, uh, we, we serve at a, a place where uh, teams from Shreveport and Monroe can come down. Centrally and, located. It's yeah, a big advantage. Yeah, we, uh, you know, I, I've been told many times, you know, I've got teams coming from New Orleans. They're going to play some teams from Shreveport, and they, mm -hmm. they can't be... You know, they're they're just ecstatic about being able well, yeah. to see someone. Some teams up in yeah. the north part yeah. of the state. Yeah, I mean, normally that's a six-hour bus ride right. or more. So. And there's a lot of local teams involved, also. Yes, yes, we uh, we we sort of set up the fence, mm -hmm. and we've got Menard coming, Grace Christian, right. obviously Pineville, Alexandria, Rapids, Ash Glenmore, on the girls' side. Um, you have Ash and Acadia Central, Tyler. Yes. Correct. Tell us a little bit about Coach Sarah. Um, I know my girls are excited. You know, they won the whole cup last year, mm -hmm. so they were the Rebel Cup champs on the girls' right. side. So now they're having to defend that title. That makes it really mm -hmm. special. So they're really excited about that. Okay, uh, let's uh, for, let's invite people out uh, to come out to watch. Only five dollars. Yep, five dollars uh, each day. Mm -hmm. um, we are we are actually it's so big we have to use Johnny Downs and the O'Hearn uh, mm -hmm. Sports Complex. Now, where's the O'Hearn Sports Complex? It's uh, it's on Bayou Rapids, but they're really about three hundred yards yeah. Uh, yeah. from each other. Just okay. down the road a little bit. Just down the right. road. Um, like the old crossroads. Yes, right. yes, yeah. ma'am. That's how um, I remember it. <laughs> it's the old crossroads facility. Um, yes. But, <clears throat> you know, like we said, it's five dollars each day. Young kids can can come and see some of the some great some, high school some, soccer. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, you know, we've got teams coming in uh, from Mandeville, who's mm -hmm. being talked as a potential uh, state champion in really? Division One. Mm -hmm. uh, Zachary on the girls has always been a strong team. Right. Uh, Ash is going to have a very strong year in their division. Right. Menard. I mean, just tons of great teams from our area, but also Some like very like we good said, competitive throughout high the school state. soccer. Sarah, how's the girl teams? Girls team shaping up. I've had a kid on the girls team for a number of years. This is the right. first year. I don't have any. You can still go out, off. Mark. Can right. Yeah. You can come watch. Um, I think we will. It seems actually. to be fairly competitive. We've seen some of the teams, you know, already this season, so they seem to be ready to yeah. put in some so work. Some boys, and, Greg. I go boys. Um, we, we're coming along. Uh, we're coming along. We, we're, we, <laughs> now y'all are rocking. We, Come we, on. We have really one person returning who's in the same position that he was in last year. Right. We, we've had, we've changed formations. We, uh, we, we, we are learning a new system and a new style, but, you know, so far we've uh, played five games. We, uh, two wins, two ties, just one loss. Um, and it's early in the season. Absolutely. We're, we're learning, so. Greg, Sarah, thanks for coming. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Thank Thank you for so much us. for being with us this morning. And again, the Rebel Cup is Friday and Saturday right here in central Louisiana. More to come, but first our community calendar.